Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to today's video. Guys, today we I have a test going on right now on my recording. I upped the quality. Uh, so I was editing yesterday's video and the quality seemed a bit off. I'm not 100% sure why. So I did some research this morning and it looks like that my output is a little bit lower than what it should be. So I upped it. Uh, now, hopefully that means that the video should be a higher quality. But what it could also mean is that there's random stutters in there if I have it too high. However, I'm not like really sure what is too high with my computer. So I have a pretty good computer. However, I'm running a one PC setup and playing the game at the same time. I didn't mess with any of the game settings. So I don't know if like I should lower any of those. I don't really want to. So we'll see if there's like any stuttering like that today or anything crazy. But hopefully in a perfect world, it's just a higher quality and that's it. Alrighty, we're gonna be hopping into some Condor hideout. Uh, the beginning of the game, which is surprising these days. I have Molotov on. Alright, you know what? I'm just gonna keep the Molotov on, to be honest. Let's just get weird with it, shall we? Uh, let's see, is anyone here gonna bust the door? I'm not sure. Guys, today, I have some inner- I wanna be pretty transparent with you guys. Uh, some things I've been thinking about. Now, anything I say in this video is not even close- That guy hurt my feelings. Not even close to, like, a set in stone- Thing or anything like that you guys can already tell by the title i want to start thinking about streaming possibly this might not happen okay but i might want to start uh, thinking about streaming on another platform and i'll explain why right now so basically i watch a lot and i mean a lot i watch every one of harris heller's videos if you guys don't know who harris heller is uh gaming or alpha gaming he's the guy who made uh stream beats and all that stuff uh he's like the reason why i'm still here uh, the reason why I say that is because it took me four years to get to 100 subscribers doing it my own way, and that didn't work. And I, like, quit on and off throughout those four years. It was not a consistent four years. And then I found his channel, and now I went from this year, this year alone, I went from 100 subscribers to now at 550. And that's just due to, like, me listening to all the advice he has to give, and it's always good advice. Now, in this, this advice that he's given is advice that a lot of people have given, which is, having multiple platforms so what does having multiple platforms mean if you don't know basically you don't want all your eggs in one basket you don't want all of your content to be on one platform so like you don't want basically i don't want youtube to be my only thing i do like i don't want all my streams and all my youtube videos just on youtube the more platforms you can have content on so like such as like let's just the the most common one is youtube videos on youtube streams on twitch and like clips on twitter instagram and or like tiktok i haven't signed, i haven't found anyone this whole time where is anyone oh there, there they are they flip spawns i guess wait that guy dude i went along that the whole time with just got an assistant of death that's crazy i guess i'll sit hill uh but so so i've always known that to be like the case uh, i used to do twitter clips and tiktok clips every day i stopped doing it because of all this commotion with tiktok that's happening so i kind of just like lost interest in it and I, w I will do that again um i just haven't i don't know and if i do like start doing it again it might just be on twitter only and instagram i don't know about tiktok but today i'm like i've always known from the very dude where where is anyone at in this lobby there we go finally if i would have died to that guy i would have been so upset but i've always known that one day i was gonna like switch from streaming on youtube to streaming somewhere else i've always known that that's always been the plan this whole time however i started streaming on youtube because i love creating youtube videos like as a primary and streaming as a secondary because with youtube videos it's easy for me to post a video like i started off three days a week i moved it up to five days a week now it's up to six days a week and i really enjoy doing it. i enjoy streaming too but it's easier for me to set uh like set a schedule for youtube videos because if i'm gonna be gone or i can't actually play for a few days i can just record videos ahead of time where you can't do that with a stream so that's why i've always kind of treated streaming as like a secondary thing because i just stream when i can whereas i actually have a set schedule for like the youtube channel our youtube videos so what does all this mean basically since i started like this year started grinding again i told myself that once i hit like a certain amount of subscribers on youtube i actually grew a nice base over here which we've we've grown a, an amazing community like a ton of friends through all this Did this guy die um i always i never knew like what the number was going to be i i kind of always thought the number was going to be a thousand but i was never like really set in sound on like what number is going to be but i've always wanted to you know i wanted to build my base here and then dude i wish i could have got that guy i wanted to build my base here and then move to another platform i just didn't know what platform or when that was gonna happen now i will say ever since we hit 500 subscribers now we're at 550 like so quickly i've considered like 
Like, I might want to make that switch sooner rather than later. I mean, we have a fantastic community here on YouTube. We have the Discord now, actually. I didn't even, like, really think to mention that. Like, we have the YouTube and the Discord, which is awesome. So, it's not like if I switch streaming on another platform, I would lose touch with everyone. Like, we're all friends. I would still post uh, my YouTube videos six days a week. And... Is, and also, like, another thing, like, it'd be easier for me to post stream highlights, because right now it's, like, kind of weird for me to post stream highlights when my stream highlights are on the YouTube channel, and then the stream highlights video is on the YouTube channel as well. It's, like, I feel like I'm just giving you the same content twice, you know what I'm saying? Whereas, if I were to move to another platform, that wouldn't be the case. So, that's that's something I've been considering. I just wanted to let you guys know that. that and that's a good thing, by the way. I, I, I guess I was kind of, the way my um, tone was kind of sounded like that was a bad thing i mean that in like the best way possible like when that day comes whether that's anytime soon or it's like right now or it's not for like another year or two like who knows whenever that day comes it's gonna be a good day because that means like i'm starting to feel comfortable enough to where i can keep my youtube uh videos going here but i can also like i feel comfortable enough to grow another community on another platform because the beauty is what you want to do is I, I would want to send all you here on YouTube over to the whatever the new platform is, which I'll tell you guys like what platform I'm heavily considering here in just a moment. Uh, I would send all you guys from here to YouTube to that platform. And then over time, you know, I would obviously grow new like followers over there on that platform, like from streaming. And I would, you know, start to send them over here as well. So then now we have two communities, but they're also like one big community. And that central hub would be the Discord channel. Or, I mean, I guess the YouTube would also be uh, the central hub. But, like, the Discord is, like, kind of, the, like, the main the main hub. You know what I'm saying? That's where, like, most of the active people stay at. Wow, look at this. I didn't even realize what the score was on this. I mean, we've been kind of... I Most of this game, I've been running around doing nothing. Just casually... I mean, my teammates have been just casually destroying these guys, but whatever. Um, so, the the chan or the platform that I am heavily considering right now... I'm going to be... I want to be super transparent with you guys is Theta, Theta.tv. If you've never heard of Theta, basically, it is the streaming platform that G Fuel owns. Hey, really quick, I wanna throw this in here. I found out, so Theta isn't 100% directly owned by G Fuel like I thought. Theta and G Fuel are partners. I just wanted to throw that in here. Enjoy the rest of the video. I cannot believe I couldn't kill that guy. It's the streaming platform that G Fuel owns, and it's, I mean, I feel like it's pretty obvious why I would want to do that, but if it's not obvious to you, G Fuel owns it, which means that if I can grow, I cannot believe this poppy shampoo guy is hurting me like this. There, jeez, I mean, that was really bad aim. I didn't know which one it was, but I got him. Uh, basically, if I can grow a really nice, like, like a community over on Theta, then that means G Fuel has a, real, I mean, you know, G Fuel will see it because they directly own Theta. Which means that we are moving that much closer to a G Fuel partnership. And guys, I feel like I've made it abundantly clear. Like, my biggest goal is to have a partnership with G Fuel. I mean, that's one of my, like, one of my many favorite things about Eastern Media is that we have a G Fuel code. Which, by the way, if you guys use code EMGG at checkout for G Fuel, DX Tracer, Meta Threats, or Scuff Gaming, you'll get a discount. And right now, G Fuel's discount code EMGG will give you 30% off through the 28th. So... That's another amazing thing. So there's not much else to it besides... Where does this guy go? There's not much else to... I mean, it's basically that straightforward. I mean, I am i don't know. Like I said, I don't know if the switch is happening anytime soon. It might happen real soon. It might not happen for another year. Might be like a month. Might be two years. Who knows? I just wanted to be really transparent with you guys that I am so appreciative of everyone here. Like everyone that has made this... Like, 550 subscribers possible is incredible. Everyone who, like, hangs out on the streams, watches the YouTube videos, likes the videos. Which, by the way, you should like this one right now. Thank you. But I feel comfortable enough that I honestly feel like any moment now, we could potentially switch to a new streaming platform. Keep our six video, like, six YouTube videos a week. The stream schedule would, would be the exact same. It would just be on a different platform that we can grow together. It would be so much fun. So I just want to let you guys know that I want to be super transparent with you guys. I'm looking at my OBS stats and it said skip frames due to encoding lag, which AKA means skips. It said that there was 45 frames skipped in total throughout that whole video. Uh, each set, each video or each second of the video is 60 frames. This is 60 frames per second video, which means that technically you guys should not have seen a single skip. Let me know in the YouTube video if you guys seen any skips, because if so, I would like to adjust the settings. 
Uh, of course, obviously, I'm trying to make this as super high quality as I possibly can, but I think it should have been fine. I mean, 45 drop frames out of thousands, and I mean thousands, like it says that my drop frames is 0.0%, like so little frames drop that it's not even counting it as 0.01%. So that is awesome. But thank you guys for watching today's video. Let me know what you guys think down below. And also, regardless, you guys should check out the Theta website. It's pretty awesome. I'm, I like watching uh, people on there. Devirus is part of EMGG. He's on there. Dill Pickle, I see him on there. And also, the Eastern Media Channel just recently got partnered on there, too. So that is awesome. Thank you guys for watching today's video. And I'll see you guys all later. Goodbye.